let's do a brief review of uh, tachometer and speedometer harnesses from Mercury. Some kind of harnesses that I have. So probably this information will be useful for someone. Let's start from the speedometer because it is the new and I have instruction for this. Uh, so it's that one part number. Yeah. So it comes with the temperature sensor. If I'm right, it comes here, not in the speedometer gauge itself. So uh, because this harness has this connection for the temperature sensor. Okay, let's step by step. Okay, let's show the temperature itself, the sensor and some uh, fastening elements. They are here. That is the cup. That is something for the installation. Well, the nut is somewhere here. Okay, so I connected this to the harness. Let's go to the harness. And you soon know why usually people don't install speedometer. So, um, that's the harness. One end goes to the junction box. So, that end goes to the junction box. I will show you everything so you can uh, pause the video and then see attentively the things that you need, if you need. Yeah, so Delphi connector. Yeah, that's the wiring. So it goes to the junction box, this side. Uh, another side goes to the gauge, yeah, and it says here gauge and, yeah, and, yeah, use with, oh, only with specific version of uh, the gauges, yeah. So, and it has place to the temperature sensor and it's written here air temperature, yeah, I already connected it. And then it has... Uh, Two cables, yeah, that's quite interesting. Two cables and G says and Mia 0183 device, yeah, and you have these cables, and that's how you can provide speed from the GPS unit to the gauge. I have a couple video about this, I will put the links in the description below. I don't want to say much here, yeah, and guys, so. Why? Uh, no, no, no. Let's let's talk about uh, tachometer harness first. So it's here. I have the old one. Uh, one end to the junction box. Where is the junction? Yeah. So you can see on wiring, on the connector, if you need it. I lost part number. Yeah, I don't know the part number. So this is to the junction box. And another end to the gauge, yeah. So, and you have what is called, uh, how it's called in English, by the way, I think system, yeah, system links here. You can connect other um, small gauges from Smartcraft, for example, voltmeter, I will do this. So, and this, this, the syst this is the system link with the cup. Again, I will show you wiring. So you can understand if you need this for some reason. Yeah, so and it has plug, uh, cover, cup. Right now you remove it, you plug the gauge and the another gauge if you need another and the cup uh, on the next gauge. So yeah, they are connected in sequence. And then you have two cables, they are for the e warning horn. Yeah, that I don't use. I even don't know what is it. <laughs> well, and for some reason I have this cable that I found out that it is for the ground. Otherwise, uh, tachometer doesn't show anything. Honestly, I don't know what is it because I didn't record the video previously before I remove it. So, uh, I don't know why it is here. And guys, now you should understand why people usually don't install speedometer, but tachometer also. Because you cannot connect other gauges to the speedometer. You can only connect them to the Tahoe gauge. The temperature sensor, why do you need it? You can install another temperature sensor. I have Blue Sea Systems. I think it, it goes to another video. And the GPS for the speedometer. Why do you need speedometer that cannot show 
the speed <laughs> yeah so you should provide it by some other device why not just read it on the another device well there are different use cases maybe it's installed in another room uh, if you have a big board or like in my case i wanted speedometer to enable trolling mode by speed but i cannot do this without puddle sensor actually so i have couple videos about this you cannot do trolling mode with just speedometer and gps speed so guys that's it i think i uh, provided you information that might be useful for you so please remember to do your comments subscribe and like this video thank you bye